Oh no, who's losing hope as a Canucks fan? <laughs> what happened? Uh, let me know what's going on there, LB. Okay, so we're doing some highlights here, right? Uh, so yeah, Jay, that's the plan for you, dude. Okay, so here's another one against Carolina. This is later on in the same game, I believe. I don't know why it wouldn't be. What goes on here? Oh, this low shot. Yes, okay. Guys, this is a move. Okay, this really is a move. This is things that you can do in regular hockey right now. Real hockey on the ice, even at the basic kid level. This is a play. If both players involved know that it's the play. If both players involved know that it's the play, right? All that's going to happen is they're going to be ready for the rebound. But as the shooter, the first shooter has to aim low pad, preferably closer to the to your player in front of the net. So you play that angle. This is a real play, okay? And yet so many people think that like it's only a good play if it counts as a goal. Like it doesn't matter what it ends up as. That's a strategy. You know? That's a play. That's not fluke. That wasn't a bad shot and some superstar forward found a way to put it in. Sometimes it is. Sometimes it straight up is. I'll give you it. I'll give you it. It's true. Sometimes it is. <laughs> but a lot of times that's a set play. I'm a defenseman, guys. I know this stuff. If I learned this at seven years old in house league, and that's as far as I went with it, you know the pros know this too. It's not fluke. A lot of what we see in real hockey on the ice is controlled chaos, man. Yes, there's luck involved, but they're ready for the luck. They anticipate the luck as much as they can. And this is all anticipation right here. You see, I know I'm controlling both players, so I know the plan. I don't even have to communicate, right? Thornton, shoot it low, and I'm gonna grab whoever's in front of the net there and try and bat it in. Boom. You know? That's a play. So try it in your own games, man. Try it in your beer league games. Try it in your NHL games. Try it. Try it. You'd be surprised how often it goes in. It's like one out of 20. It's just hard to get those. It's hard to get those because like, there's a lot that can go wrong. But you save that move for when you feel like it's your last option. When you feel like you have no other option, be ready for that. Have that as a, a, as a, a thing you can go to in your card. Your, car, your, your Rolodex, sorry, of moves, you know? Have it ready to go. Now what's this? Okay, so <laughs> this was a game that I found myself in. I didn't even realize till the first period was over, pretty much. Uh, oh, and by the way, Jay streams on uh, Sunday night, hopefully. Rays versus Blue Jays. Check it out. Check it out. Um, what's wrong with this picture? Anybody in the chat? I'll give you a minute. What's wrong with this picture? This is an online versus game, okay? So I, I choose the Leafs. I don't know who I'm going to get as my opponent, you know, uh, the ranking of them and everything like that. So you never know how good a player is going to be or not. But what's wrong with this picture? Anybody see it? I'll, I'll start knocking some stuff off the list, right? Total shots is 4-4. That's not so bad. Whatever. Right? That's totally tied. That's a beautiful game right there. That's a nice close one. Hits are 2-1 to one for me. But not a lot of hits, you know? I'm crushing it in time on attack, right? I'm crushing it on time on attack, but so what? So what? The passing is my, my passing is 93%. Like I am clearly able to control the puck around this guy and not have it get picked off, right? Or I'm making a bunch of passes behind my own net all day when he's down the other end. We know that's not happening though, guys. You know what I mean? Give me some credit here, <laughs> right? And face-offs are tied at three. But I'm losing two to one. Right? I should be mad at this, but I'm not. Why am I not mad at it? Because it's the freaking uh, Central All-Star team. You know what I mean? <laughs> this dude had the audacity to pick a, a, an All-Star team to play online versus, and I can't stop him. I can't stop him from choosing that team. I have no choice over who I go over. I didn't know this was an option. Why am I not choosing this? Why am I not choosing this? I'll tell you why. Because they suck. Okay? They suck. Uh, an all-star team versus an NHL team in the video game sense sucks. I'll show you. Okay? So that's how the first period ended. Here's something. Where are we at? 2-2 two, two now. Right? 
Seven left in the second. I try that little move again, but it doesn't work so good because I ill-timed it. Chuck it in front. What are we doing here? What are we doing? I don't even know. How, I don't remember how this play went down. Am I going to one-time it? Yeah, I am. <laughs> it didn't go in, though. So what are we watching? The pass out in front? Oh, this beauty walkout backhand thing. That's just a good one, man. <laughs> right? But if we look at it again from about, like, let's say about here. He never really gets much going, man. You know, the Leafs are all over him. I got all the puck control. I'm reading the bounces. You know, you gotta kind of know where a rebound's going first. They just let me walk right out in front. You know? Hey, Dan, how you doing, man? <laughs> uh, yeah, well, feel free to sound off in the chat, man, if you think I'm an idiot when it comes to this strategy stuff. You know? <laughs> and then we're actually gonna play some hockey later on, too. So if you wanna see me struggle against, uh, you know, high schoolers and stuff online, that's also fun. Just to see me get owned by these young kids and stuff. <laughs> Get embarrassed, you know? Okay, where are we at? 4-4 now in the third. Right? Toronto's hanging in there against the Central All-Stars, mind you. Right? Let's keep that in mind, folks. What are we doing here? A little drop back to Hall. That's dangerous, man. He was the last man back. I probably shouldn't have done that. But in the moment, you make mistakes and you just try to adapt, right? But none of his guys can work together as a team, man. These All-Star teams don't work well as a team. It's just for pure goals. So as long as I block his shots and stuff, I get stuff like that. You know what I mean? He's having no control. I'm just aggressive. I'm on the puck. And Matthews with that shot, though, eh? Matthews with that shot. Oh. I know. I know. It wasn't there in the playoffs, guys. I'll be the first to admit it. It wasn't there in the playoffs. Okay. It happened. It's not going to happen every year, guys. Look how good this guy is. Look how good Matthews is in digital form. <laughs> Okay, 5-4. Oh, yeah, that was... I guess that was right before the... The third was going to be over when I scored that, no? Right, and this is how you close... Okay, so that's why I'm showing you this. So, I scored that, right? There's not much time left. This is how you properly close out a game. Okay? If you're only up by a goal... This is what you do. Any level. Ready? Win the face-off first, that's great, but you can't always do that. But once you have it, right, pin it up along the boards. Five seconds left? I probably could have done it even sooner, and honestly, if they saw me doing that, those guys might even back off a little bit because they realize, they realize I got them. You know what I mean? If it was just a regular season game, whatever, there's nothing on the line, and I started doing that, that killing it in my own zone like that, just hanging on to it, because all you're doing is not wanting to give up control. Right? Seven seconds left by this point. Just don't turn it over. Keep control. Now, it's not this easy to do in real life, especially on the NHL level. It's not. This is bad AI. But that being said, he can do it to me, too. So it is fair. That's actually the respectful way to do it. Instead of trying to go down and... Like, if this is in real life, especially. You go down, you try and blast one off to try and, like, cement it with seven seconds left. You're risking injuring somebody. You're risking getting one of your guys injured. You know, I'm not saying quit on the play. If luck kind of goes your way as the guy is down by a goal, yeah, it's your duty to seize upon that opportunity. Watch. If this guy gets me at any point, he wins that face off, he should try and score. You know what I mean? If he gets it at any point here, he should be dishing it out front trying to get a desperation shot on net. Absolutely. He has an obligation to win this game. I have an obligation not to embarrass him. And guys, I had control, right? It'd be different. If he was struggling to get there, if I was struggling to keep the puck away from him, then you go down, then you try and score or whatever else like that. You know what I mean? But clearly I have control. So the respectful thing to do, you kids at home, is to kill it in your own corner. Okay? If it's safe to do so, that's your judgment call. If you want to be classy, that's the way to do it. Oh, geez. Next one. That's how this game ended, okay? So that's a that's a all-star team in an online versus against Toronto. This is how it ended. Look at that. 14 minutes of time on attack to his seven. Right? That's a lot, man. That's a lot. That's double the time in a long game. 
very little neutral zone play on either side. Well, I mean, it's not on either side, but you know what I'm saying. You know, I got time on attack and so did he, but like there was very little in between. He was always in one of the zones. That's a that's a heavily offensive game. He, he crushed me on the face-offs. Right? But he's got the superstar players. He's got the, the, the all-star players. That's why that's how he can keep it within one goal against a team like Toronto. You know what I mean? That can't be allowed, EA. Come on, man. You can't have people choosing an all-star team against an NHL team. You know, come on, man. <laughs> I'm lucky I'm good. <laughs> I'm lucky I'm good, you know? But still, please fix that, please.